Okay, we're back. Let's go into the lair and start clearing this stuff out. Try to fight one thing at a time here. Actually, there's a decent choke point here, as long as we don't run into anything like a Hydra or a Spiny Frog. Although, even if we do, I can just walk away from everything, so... But yeah, these plants make a pretty decent choke point. And there's our Spiny Frog. Things can still do quite a lot of damage to me, so it's no joke. And kiting them is a little bit obnoxious because of how fast they are. But we still have an insanely more easy time with them than just about any other character, so. We don't need these rings. We're not casting anything. In fact, we can't cast anything. Oh. Mamba is actually faster than me. So of course we use heroism on anything that's that we can't get away from, or anything that uh, I just, just need a little bit of help on, you know. Hydra here. Take, uh, it took quite a few shots, but, you know, we took it out. We do not have our cold, so this is the kind of thing we want to be very careful around. They die easily, but they can also do really high cold damage. Oh, got a ghost. Looks like it's just a Minotaur Berserker. Acid, this dude. Hmm. You know what? Let's clear some of this floor out. The acid didn't really do much to him. I would like to be able to kite him around. Looks like this is a rather contested floor.
Spriggan Venom Mage. Oh, and he can Dazzle Spray me. However, I am our poise, so... Let's just get him with the... Um, hmm. I was going to say get him with the arrows, but this OTR could be a real issue. I'm going to see if I can kill him with this. Okay. I probably should have finessed there, but, you know, it worked out. this one dude it's gonna be good when I have a nice bow rather than this Sort of clunky short bow plus two. This is one reason I prefer Trog over Oka to a large degree. Um, Trog is, I wouldn't say guaranteed, but pretty assured to give you a longbow sooner than Oka will. Because Trog gives nothing but gifts of weapons. His gifts are all weapons, is what I'm saying. Uh, and ammo. So, you know, at the very least, he's going to give you some short bows. The chance of him just not giving you any, any gifts in your chosen weapon is pretty low. I'll take the chance of going into the darkness. It's fine. I'm a centaur. What could happen? There we go. Hate these death yaks one at a time, but they're not a problem, you know, in reality. It's just that they add a little bit of tedium, but there's no danger at all here, thanks to the fact that I'm a centaur. Alright, here's that ghost. We are much faster than this ghost. I don't want him to get shafted. Heroism, finesse. Effectively hasted. Got him. I found a longbow. Of 
resource, we will use it. It's not branded, but neither was my short bow. See how much faster we kill death yaks. No need to kite them really as long as I get my hits in. Gotta watch out for these dream sheep. You'll notice I'm only letting one be on the screen with me at the same time, if possible. That's because the more the more that can see you, the more likely you are to get put to sleep. There's two. Wouldn't be the end of the world if I got slept by these guys because they seem to be alone. But if one of these death yaks had shown up, then we would have a real problem, huh? distance and go to work. Hydras are, you know, you can make short work of them very, very easily on a centaur, which is pretty cool. snail. Thankfully he was alone. Hey! Okawaru comes through and brings me centaur barding. Sweet. Okay, let's walk away from the blown off. Um, I was saying we should walk away from this manticore. It's okay. Um, darn. It's okay, we have blink if need be. I should use heroism. I should have used heroism before. Alright, cool. Wanda Clouds came through for me. it. There we go. I was going to say, he can't really one-shot me. My AC is not completely miserable, um, and I have 120 hit points, so... Enchant the cloak of poison resistance. Oh, 
Oop. Well, we have RF, so this is no big deal. But we still would like to keep him at ranged if possible, in case we have to run. In fact, I'll go ahead and heroism. Okay, done. We could wear the fire dragon scales. Um, we don't have any RC plus to offset them, so. Sleep. It's being a little sloppy there. I was letting two be on the screen with me. Oh boy, it's this one. should have a merfolk avatar in the center and plenty of hydros. All kinds of assorted nastiness. Hey, it's a uh, requirement. Now we're not worshiping Trog for once in a great long while. So instead of acquiring a book, which will probably give me a spell book, we're going to acquire a weapon. A ruined short bow. Um, I'd rather have my generic longbow, to be honest. Even if it is fiery. So that sucks. We got a little bit. Uh, we got a little bit ripped off there, but I mean, what do you expect? It's acquirement. Acquirement is never guaranteed to be good. We've enjoyed a tremendous benefit from them almost every time when we worship Trog, but that's a very special case. As for this dude, um, let's let's pull him all the way back to the staircase. Then we're gonna hex him. We get lucky and succeed the first time. And we'll just kill him in melee, or we'll just kill him in melee while he's not hexed. That's fine too. some barbs damage just to get into this kill hole usually a good thing to do when faced with that choice the avatar. Heroism, finesse. This is a big enough threat that it's worth breaking out the tools. Uh, 
Uh, sort of a disappointing loot pile. On the other hand, it had haste, and that's good enough for me. And the scroll summoning. So, you know, not bad. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Dreams. Okay, um, my MR is not not great yet. Um, let's finish our dungeon and see where we are. We do have some options. In fact, I'm gonna go ahead and train evocations to like five. because I may be using things like that feel of floods to deal with orc sorcerers soon. Okay, we got slammed by that large rock. Oh, and another one. First, we'll get this wand as well because it could be something useful, and we'll get identify. Just wand of flame. That sucks. Uh, why don't we identify the potions? And now we will use acquirement on a weapon, a ruined longbow. All right, we have our in-game weapon. Amazing stuff. Oh, um, Heroism Finesse. We sh should be okay against this. If not, I'll blink. I am RF+, plus, and he does have Hellfire, but he dies very quickly to my new Freezing Longbow. Nessos, with a longbow flaming, and a centaur barding. We'll carry around flaming just in case. I will go ahead and enchant my centaur barding a stealth up. We'll probably be using that for the rest of the game, depending on if we find another one. Black, Black Knight's horse barding or something. Unlikely. As you can see, uh, once we get that longbow with a brand on it. The character really just takes off and kills everything in one shot. Or a couple shots. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is okay. We petrified for a minute. That's fine. Fortune. I guess I'll learn Yara's. Probably not going to use it. Can't cast any gloves anyway. Hmm. Well, we 
have access to RC Plus now. I want to put on FTA. Probably not forever, but just for now. And we'll wear the Ring of Ice. I would like to have an MR Plus ring, but no such luck. should check out this plate armor. Oh, okay. I guess we're using this uh, for the extra MR. Orc Sorcerers now have a 2% chance to paralyze me. Pretty low. Not guaranteed, but pretty low. That means I'm comfortable probably being in line of sight with them for like one or two turns or line of fire I should say but not if they're next to me that's the biggest thing is if you have to risk being paralyzed by one of those guys don't don't be nearby because if they're next to you the very next thing they can do is summon like a six fur he which then proceeds to murder you in about three turns this guy has iron shot. Um, okay, worst case scenario, I'll blink. Let's see how much he can actually do. Now that I'm losing hit points. 3d26, so not as much as the amount of hit points that I have. I should have heroismed, by the way. And, in fact, I should have... should have finessed as well. staircase. This one's less bad. I'm only to pull two things at a time here, so I'm okay with it. Can I be agonied? Yeah, I guess so, but unlikely. up here. Would rather not be next to oh wait, that's not a stone giant, that's a that's a zombie. No problem then. can be banished, paralyzed. Or confused by that wizard. Or slowed. Hmm. 
what to do about this. I'm thinking we use um, acid. I'll just fire, I guess. He should die of the poison before he can kill me. There we go. Probably should have finessed there before he was in range of me. Slight misplay. digging so I just walk right by that swap to uh, flaming for these guys since they're not resistant to fire the melee eyes are probably a much bigger threat than the vampire but I saw that it was hurt I wanted to finish it off Establish range and rest off the damage from the large rocks. I want to identify this roll. I'm hoping to find some more enchant weapons soon. That would be good. Okay, now we're only 30 minutes in, we've cleared out Lair and Dungeon. Let's go into Orc. Actually, Erolcha cannot do all her nonsense to me now, so let's just kite. Wait, is she hasted? Oh, she is. She's got Crystal Spear, too. Heroism and Finesse. Come on. There we go. That's one threat dealt with. Okay, back to Orc. This landing is a bit... congested. monsters, but it's all weak stuff. It would be much worse if it was a orc sorcerer. We got Urug. Should be able to just tap him. Got him.
Only high level orc we've seen so far is that high priest. He went down pretty easily. This one should too. Hopefully. Yeah. Looks like Oka gave me a longbow. Velocity, huh? Uh, yeah, we'll just stick to that for simplicity's sake. Now this would be a situation where it's really, 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 really bad if I get paralyzed. This is not a situation I want to stick around in. Instead, we're going to magic map. I'm going to go down a different way. And in fact, we're going to open this up as well. Really not afraid of anything in here, except for the sorcerer. But again, as long as I maintain maximum range on them, I'm not too afraid of them. I will not buy Box of Beasts just yet. It's kind of useless to me until I train up evocations, and I may not do that for a while. I'll put it on the list, though. Books. Yeah, minor magic might be useful for blink. Actually, um, I do need to look up Okawaru Wrath. I hear it's quite bad. It's been a long time since I've dealt with it. I guess it's, um, Titans and things. Hmm. And quite a lot of them. stuff peter out on its own Got two more shops that we haven't checked yet, so there could be something good in here. Not in here. Oops, don't want to fire at the demon. I'll take out that guy. 
shiny ice dragon scales. Well, no thanks. Shops in here were no good. Sometimes that happens. Let's see, 40 minutes in. Um, hmm. I guess I could do. I guess I could do shoals real fast. Um, or maybe spider. My EV is zero, by the way. That's exciting. It's because of the centaur barding. And my plate mail and my complete lack of training. Looks like we got longbones to 22, which is where it will stay for as long as I'm worshipping Oka, since I can bring it to 27 at, at any moment. Ah! Even on this character, I'm not wearing harm. We've, we've seen how that's very bad. I'll just deal with the drain. It'll end before too long. And of course I've got, you know, I've got the ability to use heroism, which I'll do right now. Maybe I should recharge this clouds. over there, that's cool. Um, yeah, on, on this we're gonna leave. There's too much stuff at the same time. Got a helmet from Oka. Oh my! Strength plus 10. Is that worth the MR minus? Um, I guess. Probably. Hmm. Where's our, our poise coming from? Ah, the cloak. Hmm. We'll use it. It should increase my damage. I believe strength increases uh, longbow damage. Seems like we're doing some serious work. to beat plus 10 strength on an item that's pretty incredible. That's the point where I start to I start to care about stat bonuses. Normally I see a stat bonus and I'm just not terribly interested. But plus 10 is pretty insane. We can even go invisible now because of it, so that's cool. Hopefully, we find like some 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 something like four wins or just you know anything with a couple pips of MR on it. That'd be kind of cool. It's always good when you get items that shore up the weaknesses of other items. I 
I mean, don't get me wrong, I value MR insanely highly, but the benefit that 10 strength is going to give me is uh, kind of hard to, hard to overlook. through a shaft. Generally, when your shaft, you'd like to get up to the floor you were back on, or excuse me, you would like to, you would like to get up to the previous floor as quickly as possible. That's what I'm saying. Um, you uh, you don't want to stick around on a floor that's partially explored, and then if you go up through an unexplored staircase, you're gonna end up fighting stuff that you should have already cleared by now, but didn't because of the shaft. So. Try to try to get up as soon as you can. Finding lots and lots of scrolls. We can't have too many that are unidentified left. Four of them. Okay, um, got an artifact here, uh, that's, that's exactly what I was looking for, sort of, uh, that's MR+, plus. that's pretty awesome. Um, we'll just wear C Invisible. Um, wow, what a great ring. RC plus, RF plus, MR plus, R poise. Wow, I mean, what else could I possibly want? I'm confused right now, but that's okay. Let me pull out the sword. there, but no big deal. We can almost outrun the orb. Not really, but almost. Okay, well, we're next to something that's very nasty that could paralyze me, so let's open up with clouds so that something's happening while I'm being paralyzed if that happens. Uh, I'm gonna emulate. So all this stuff just dies. I probably should have blinked away from that, honestly. Since I could have been paralyzed. On the other hand, being paralyzed doesn't really do much to me. Most of my... Most of my defenses are wrapped up in AC, which isn't really impacted, I don't think, at all by being paralyzed. Maybe. Oh man. OK, 
Okay, good. He's confused. Those things are rather con concerning. They do quite a lot of damage. Um, I mean, they're, they're no big deal, really, if you have our elect. But I don't. So. Our first Phantom Mirror. pretty well prepared to do um, slime if I so chose. Of course we'll do this in the usual order for safety's sake. It can be fun to do things in a weird order like slime first or there's even a challenge for example where you go to depths before getting a single rune and you have to go into just just depths and hell or just depths and pan to win the game and that that can be fun but it's not optimal it's just a challenge um, I don't know if I would uh, ever think about doing that on a streak I mean that seems crazy but depending on the character it could be good you know it could be doable Take a look at the spider loop before I jog on. Actually, what I should do is I should go pick up this thing. Arlek. I'd rather have MR+, plus, particularly in Shoals, where I have to deal with getting mesmerized. these dudes. Um, I've misplayed here. I'm in heroism, which I should have done a while ago. Uh, you know what? I'm going to heal wounds. I need these guys dead. Try to confuse that, it's not quite working. Um, invis. Yes, we are invisible. Just walk away from the stuff. How much does this do? 24 plus strong poisoning. Um, Okay, he's charmed. Now, unfortunately, I can't just shoot him. Because Oko would get mad. So we had to do that. Send him away and then have some time to heal. Oh, it's Donald. Let's not just tab this dude. Um, hmm. I will phantom mirror him, I will heroism, and we'll kill him. Going plate armor. Well, there's a chance that it'll be better. Uh, for some reason, Oka has given me a shield. Just out of pure curiosity, I'm going to put it on. 
It's a very nice shield. Too bad we're using bows. We now have blink. Didn't have to pay for it, that's cool. Thought about buying it from that workshop, but no need to really if it's gonna drop on the ground, which it usually does. A little surprised we aren't getting more mesmerized, but I guess even two pips of MR. Well, three now. Oh, right. Yeah, I got the, I got the ring. I was, uh, I forgot I had that MR. So yeah, we're up to three, which makes us almost immune to all the stuff in here. We'll buy spiders. Um, you know, I would like to have one of these rods, but is it worth buying? I'm gonna go with. I'm going to go with yes. And we have our F++, so this little miniature um, flaming vault doesn't really scare me. Train armor and dodging up to ten each. We stop at twenty two on bows and fighting because of heroism, taking it to twenty seven. Pro magic. Well, now we've got all the pro magic we'll ever need. Probably. Uh, still not quite immune to an ancient lich, but we will be as we level up. So I'm gonna keep that on, and we'll we'll just swap on see invisible if need be. We used up our clouds. Why don't we grab this other one? identify it. Drop some of these other ones that I don't need. Quite a few, um, quite a few ones have spawned. It always blows my mind that there are people in this game who will just never, they'll just never train evocations. And it's just weird to me because the game gives you this whole class of items that's incredibly powerful. And there's a certain type of player who will just act like it's not there, you know? We are marked. We don't want to be marked. Um, okay. We'll blink out of this. I moved, I tried to move out of that net a couple times, and despite, despite my tremendous strength, it was a no-go. Some interesting spells here in the Book of Battle.
You know, I'm a little shocked at how few arrows I have. Boca's really not coming through for me on the on the ammo supply. Usually I would have a little bit more of a stockpile by now. If it keeps up, I may have to keep Oka, you know, for a very long time. Hopefully I find Faith soon. Now I could be using, I, should, I could be swapping off to my sword and, you know, doing that occasionally, but... Sounds miserable, honestly. Amulet of Reflection. Why don't we turn stones all the way off? I do not want to pick those up. But yeah, it's just tedious to have to swap to a melee weapon. And it really isn't necessary if you're worshipping a god that gives you ammo. Anyway, it's it's fine. Once I do elf, um, we'll get plenty of ammo. It helps a lot to get snake in a uh, in a run where you're using bows because then you get extra arrows. It's kind of a shame when you don't, but it's not the end of the world either. Okay, we have we have a pip of our cold. And we spawned right next to this thing. Oh, I'm right next to this dude. Weapon of electrocution, huh? Uh, okay, I'm gonna heroism. I'm gonna finesse. Hmm. I'm going to poison the negative energy. I'm gonna make that thing. We'll just try to kill him real quick. Okay, not, not a problem. He was rather fragile to be in here at all. Um, I, can, I can see how he died if that was all the defense and hit points that he had. He probably got one-shotted by something nasty in here. He didn't even have cold resistance. The ghost didn't. So he could have easily just gotten clouded, like turn the corner immediately get clouded. That's the kind of character I think I would walk out of an ice cave on. Okay, that's that armor's terrible. Anything with star slow on it is a really bad idea to wear. Now, this little vault can be obnoxious if you don't have ranged, but I do. That's better than a plus three longbow velocity. But that is a very good weapon. Fire resistance. Um, we're going to wear the fire resistance plate instead of MR. now. 
I may swap back later. We'll see. Um, anyway, why don't we go ahead and do we want to enchant it up? I mean, having RF plus 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 sounds pretty fun. On the other hand, we're doing so well that I don't know if I need to enchant anything right now. You know what? Um, let's do it. Might as well go for the... You know, if ever you're not sure, just go for it. Get the defense. Get the AC right now. I mean, this character didn't really need it, but I'll still take it. For the immediate survival. Alright, Heroism, Finesse. I'll aim for Ilsui. Um, actually, do we have... we have Immolation. Losing a few arrows here. out of the deep water. We fire and he dies. Thankfully, the tide cooperates. Of course, we can kill them pretty fast before they can get that enormous water strike damage on me, really. Hold up, why don't we go ahead and pick up, um, oh come on, get out of the water. There we go. Alright, I want to pick up this lamp of fire. Really useful to have. Wow. Pearl dragon scales. bad I already enchanted this up. I knew Oka would find a way to make me to make me regret that. Uh, I'll consider enchanting up the Pearl Dragon Scales. They're pretty much the best type of armor in the game. Arguably. check out this ring. It's a really good ring. It's strictly better than pro magic, so 
There it goes. Wow. Incredible stuff. We found some great, great, great items this game. Kraken will not come out of the deep water. Flames don't want to do anything. I'll waste some arrows on them. We don't have a ton of arrows to spare though, so I should probably start being careful with those. Like so. I mean, I have this scimitar electricity. It's not like I, I can't use my side weapon. Hmm. I guess I could learn some pole arms. You know, I mean, I'm not going to find four million arrows in elf, so it is a bit of a problem. Well, we'll cut the video here. Why don't we just check out what the options are? Um, demon tridents nothing too great maybe if we find like a like a bardic uh, or, or a glaive ideally a glaive maybe it would be worth training these pole arms otherwise not so much I mean really I'm I'm reticent to train that stuff at all really I just really want my uh, I just really want more arrows. Okay, so we're doing awesome. We have almost 200 hit points. We have, other than Arlek, we have Omni Resistance. So that tells me that we can go into, um, we could probably go into Elf, clear it out. Which I would really like to do, again, because I need the arrows more than anything. So next run we'll do that, or next uh, next video. I'll clear out Elf, and I will uh, probably go to Slime. Until then, I'm signing out.